Hey guys, welcome back to M1 and Mix. Just wanted to show you quickly the update to Native Instruments Reactor. It's uh, now Reactor 6.3.0 and there's been some major improvements and features added to this version. So I wanna jump straight into it. Let's go straight to the screen. You're on M1 and the Mix. Alright guys, so here um, I've just got an empty MIDI track open in Ableton Live. I'm just going to plug in a Reactor 6 uh, VST here. Now the first thing you'll notice straight away, very quick loading time of course, but this is brand new in Reactor 6. We now have the ability to select what we want to do. Are we playing? Are we going to create a patch, which I'm going to go over very briefly? Or are we going to build, which I'm sorry, I'm just not even going to show you because I haven't got no idea how to build synthesizers at this stage. It's just getting too hectic. But the possibility is definitely there. If you're a designer or a builder of samplers, effects and synthesizers, then you can press this option here, which you could do all these functions before, but now you've obviously uh, got the added ease of selecting where you want to go, which is absolutely fantastic. Um, so as far as instruments goes, not a lot has changed really. I mean, just depending on what instruments you own, depending on which complete version you own, sorry, um, those instruments should still be there. So obviously I can select play. Uh, once I click on this, this will load now all my reactor instruments. Alright guys, so it's opened up rounds here as my default instrument, so you should be able to hear that, I'll just pull out my keys. I really love rounds, it's an awesome thing. Um, but yeah, all, all the standard instruments are here. I can open these, um, contour, uh, molecular. Was pretty nice actually, I like some of that. <clears throat> very organic sort of analog sounds, very cool. Yeah, so there's really not that much that's changed. I think the main thing is that, you know, the user interface is much easier at the start, so you can actually select what you want to do, instruments and so forth. Um, so here's our TAK one, this is an incredible... idea we're not here to show off that so now the other thing I want to show you is um, so obviously when you open up reactor I'll uh, open it up again you get this uh, interface here which has the patch and the build as well now if we select patch this is really cool because now we can actually patch and create our own instruments this is what I really wanted to show in this video it's really quite fun so you can add um, different elements, different instruments. Now we can go back to what I was talking about before, this uh, Blocks Primes here. And if we um, select uh, Monarch Oscillator, because we need a sound generating oscillator in our patch, uh, patch bay here, or whatever you call it, I don't know what you call this, patching. So there you can select it, you can put it in, very simply. Now the next bit is how to get sound in there. Obviously MIDI's functioning, because uh, when I click the keys, the note in is going. Um, but let's say, uh, well one we want to have level, we want to have some level control, so um, we put that in here, there we go, so that's actually going, you can see it's feeding through, we can't hear it, um, so we just simply put that in there, and so now, um, I mean it's not making a very great sound, and for the sake of this video I'm just going to turn that down, so it's in the background there, um, and then we can do fun things like, uh, let's put our notes onto our pitch. There we go. And that essentially we've just made a sustained, sustained note synthesizer. But I can control the oscillator here as well. The range, the type of waveform. Alright, so we unplug it from the level. Let's put it into, I don't know, just into in, I guess. Do we need stereo? I don't know. There we go. Oops, I turned it off. So put it in again. There we go, and then we go out to level. Level 1 and 2 on stereo. And now if I go here, yeah, we've got a filter. 
Anyway, guys, that's all I wanted to show you today. Thanks for joining me on Animal Mix. Sweet little update. Get it now. It's free if you already own Reactor. Alright, guys, make sure to subscribe to the channel, like the video if you want to see more, and thanks for watching. Peace out.